um, today it, I am going to be cleaning some tack. It is a very fall-like day here in northern Vermont um, and my tack hasn't been cleaned for about a week so I'm going to get moving on that. Uh, and I've got a bucket of warm-ish water here. I just opened this brand new thing of uh, tack cleaner and it's goat's milk saddle soap. It smells amazing. It's lavender. Um, taking care of the leather of your tack is really important. I probably don't wash it enough. Um, I try to do about once a week. Um, I mean, you shouldn't wash it every time you ride either, so you kind of have to strike a balance. Um, so, and this saddle soap even came with a sponge, which is really nice. Let it soak in there. The sponge is brand new and it's already kind of gross. Since I subbed up what I want, I'll take a cloth, wipe it off. You don't want to leave the soap on there to form a residue. And this is just a quick clean. There's also, you can do a deep clean where you take, I mean, not really taking the saddle apart, but the bridle you can take apart. I'm not going to do that today. I only do that a couple times a year. Man, if you like lavender, this stuff is nice. I have my grab strap on here for, I don't really need it anymore. I had it on there for Cantering Lulu, but my son also uses it when he rides. Um, it definitely helped me when I was learning to canter her, still kind of learning to canter her, but when it was uh, more of a process, I, uh, this was definitely helpful to keep me in the saddle and sort of bouncing around and possibly pulling on her mouth or something, which wouldn't be a good, a good experience. You want everything to be a good experience for them, no matter what you do. At least you try to.
right, so that's the saddle. Doesn't take too long. Um, and now basically go through that exact same process with the, the girth and the bridles and my boots. Um, it's pretty much the same. Suds it up and wipe it off. Now it's all nice and shiny. Weather's conditioned. And when you take care of your tack, it lasts forever. Um, I hope that this video has been informative and that you've enjoyed it. Um, if you did, please hit subscribe and I will have another video again uh, another time. Have a good one.